Hi, it's me again with Corel Roll Tips and Tricks, and I think I've covered this before, but somebody emailed me and I can't really find the, the video. I've got an 18 by 18 inch square. I'm gonna make my nudge distance two inches. I'm gonna select my rectangle. I'm gonna to go to object and I'm gonna convert it to a curve or control Q. I'm gonna take my shape tool and then you have your node. I'm gonna select that node. I'm gonna use the left arrow key. I'm gonna select that node. I'm gonna get the right arrow key. Now our nudge distance was two. So now it should be 22 on the bottom and 18 on the top. So there you kind of have a pyramid and you could nudge it at any point. And if you ever want to do something like that and you're checking it to see if it's perfect, control D, make a duplicate of it as long as your object origin is in the center. When you mirror it, it's going to be exactly the same because it's it's a perfect shape. Now, if you mirror this, this way, then the bottom's on the top. And there's just another little inside if you ever needed that shape. There you have that shape. Anyway, I hope that helped them a little bit. Thank you for watching.